Anybody else? Oh, yeah. Hi, uh, Newt Gingrich has uh, anointed himself as the Republican <laughs> nominee. That. But you were talking about nominee. right. You were talking about Iowa and character, and I was reading that there's a revolt amongst evangelical Christians in Iowa that are kind of upset because there's a pastor's pack that might endorse him. I don't personally. They, they aren't going to endorse. Yes, uh, he he had given the. the word. He had given the, oh, there we go. Good. Who is going to benefit, you think, when Newt makes his inevitable plunge? Well, you see, I, you can look at this as a progression in some respects, uh, which is, you know, you're looking at it from the standpoint of, um, you know, it's sort of the hype candidate uh, to the, you know, sort of the cool candidate. Uh, and so after the hype, which was Perry, and sort of the cool candidate, which was Kane. People were saying, okay, you know, maybe we need someone who's actually thoughtful uh, and experienced and cool in the sense, you know, he's you know, smart and he, makes, he beats up on the press and he beats up on Obama and he's, good, he's glib. So he went to Gingrich and now we're looking, how about thoughtful, steady, and, you know, reliable, all the, you know, sort of steady Eddie. Uh, that that I think that's sort of the, the progression. As people get closer to the election, uh, that's what they're going to start looking for. They're, they don't they they don't want someone who can blow this. Right. They want someone who's 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 reliable, who's steady, who you know what he's going to do because of what he's done. And, uh, and so I'm I'm am you know increasingly confident that uh, when people take a look at us, we're going to be you know. The, uh, the you know the uh, the Goldilocks. We're going to be just right uh, when it comes to uh, to this suit. Good luck. Or, yeah. Yeah. All right.